guys. Thank okay. you. On the morning of May 21, South Korean time, residents of the city of Seoul suddenly heard a loud emergency alarm on their electronic devices. At first, they thought that it was an attack from North Korea. On May 21, at around 6.32 a.m. South Korean time, residents of the city of Seoul received an extremely loud emergency alarm on their electronic devices that read, Civilians prepare to evacuate and please ensure that children, the elderly and the disabled can evacuate first. The alarm claimed that North Korea had launched a space launch vehicle SLV towards South Korea warning the towns people of the potential riot threat. However, about 10 minutes later a new alert was issued clarifying that the alert was a false alarm. The SLV launched by North Korea blew towards the Yellow Sea and posed no potential threat to residents of the city of Seoul. However, this has led to a lot of speculation. North Korea launched satellite. In this case, soldiers are usually required to return to the unit even if they are on vacation. As is known, on May 23, in 2023, Jin became the squad leader and completed the release ceremony for the trainees he had educated in five divisions. Because of this, Jin as an assistant instructor was given three days off depending on how many days he got. Could have been more than three days. Because of this pass alarm, soldiers who get off work are required to return to the barracks and must be prepared for the current situation. However, it is yet to be confirmed whether Jin is back at the barracks and carrying out his military duties again or whether this pulse alarm did not make it happen. Hopefully, we'll hear back from Jin and J-Hope on their holiday. Okay, bye-bye.